in this equation we need to fill this trace table. So we have function, a procedure at the top which we don't need to run just yet. So we start with the repeat equals true. So repeat is set to true. Then we've got while repeat is equal to true. So yes, repeat is equal to true. So we set that to true as well. Then we've got num equals int input. So we're asking the user for a number. Because this is an input, we use the number 88 right at the top, which is given in the question. Then it says game and then open a parenthesis, close it, and then num. So num is going to be the argument. So num, which is 88, will be passed all the way to num, which is right at the top here in the procedure. So dev game num. So now, because we called our procedure, we're going to run our procedure. So it says, if num is greater than 100, nope, that's incorrect. Else, if num is less than 100, yes, that's true. So we display low because num is less than 100. And now we're done with our procedure. We exit it. Then it says if num is equal to 100, then we set repeat false. So is num equals to 100? No, that's false. So we put false there. Repeat is still true. So we start the while loop again. While repeat is equal to true. Yes, that's still true. Next number is 155. Then we pass in 155 to the function because game, we're calling uh, the procedure. We're calling the procedure game, so we're going to the top. So 155. If num if 155 is greater than 100, yes, that's true. So we display high. Then we're done with the procedure. We go to if num is equal to 100. That's false. Repeat is still true. And while repeat is equal true, yes, that's still true. Next number is going to be 15. 15 is low when we run the function, uh, well, the, when we run the procedure, and then that's still false. Repeat is still true, and while repeat is still uh, equals true, that's still true. Next number is 102. 102, we're going to pass 102 into num, and we run the procedure, and this will display high. And then num is equal to 100, that's still false. Then we've got repeat, that's still true, and that's still true. Next number is 100. So 100 will be passed to game num, and num will pass the value of 100 to the procedure at the top, and then it will say bingo now, because it will go to the else because if num is greater than 100, that's false. Num is less than 100, that's false, so go to bingo. Then we've got, um, if num is equal to 100, yes, that's true. Now, because it's true, it says repeat equals false. So we set repeat to false. And now it goes back to the top, while, so while repeat is equal to true. So while repeat is equal to true, that's false, because repeat is now not true. So we finish our, our trace table like that. Now all of these values will be the same anyway, so you don't need to fill them at the bottom.